Yo, so I've been using the Backbone 1 PlayStation controller for about a month now. And in this video, we're going to take a look at the Backbone app and all the features it has to offer. Such as how it works, how to add your friends, start a party, message them. Do you really need a membership? Is the app worth it? How to play Xbox, PlayStation, PC games, anywhere. No console, no problem. How to play on any screen. How to invite your friends so you and your friends get $10 on gaming perks. Disclaimer, this video is not being sponsored. I bought, did purchase the Backbone 1 PlayStation controller with my own money, and I'm gonna give you guys my honest opinion. So let's hop into the video. So after you have purchased your Backbone 1 controller, whether it's the PlayStation Edition or the original, you wanna go on your Android or your iPhone or device. Me personally, I'm gonna use iPhone, and go to the app store on android it's going to be the google play store you want to search for the backbone app you want to install it onto your device once installed you want to connect your phone to the backbone controller and then you're going to follow the on-screen instructions to get yourself all set up if you have an iphone 13 pro pro max 14 14 pro max there's a little adapter that comes in the box the package this is it right here so you want to make sure you use this for your iphone 13 pro pro max 14 pro pro max it's for the camera layout because the, the cameras are much bigger the lenses so it does help protect and the way you put this on there real quick you want to take this here it is right here as you can see you take this and you just place it literally on top and push it back there's only one way that it goes so you'll see how it goes on there Thought I heard somebody outside. But uh, in this section, I'm gonna show you how to add friends, how to start a party chat, how to even message you. You can even add me if you want to. So right here, the way you wanna do is you wanna add friends. Top left corner, you wanna hit the menu icon, tap on that, here'll be your friends chat list. You wanna tap the icon right next to your name, which will be right here. This is how you're gonna add your friends. You can search for their username and this will show you what people you may know. And yes, these are the real content creators like Nate Shot, Marshmello, uh, Courage JD. I don't know who this is, but yes, these are the real. You can just search their username. You can add me if you want to. So I'll put it across the screen. Hit me up. I need some friends. But here is your section right here for rooms. You got join joinable rooms you can join. See, I got a friend right there. I did add Courage. That is the real Courage JD. The message icon, you can sit right here. This is how you message your friends, you know, chat rooms, stuff like that. Got your photo library from recorded gameplay. You got your settings. It's pretty much it on settings. You got your account information, you know, just a controller. Yes, you can also stream on Twitch and YouTube, which is good. Now, if you click on your profile right here, so you do see my name right there, it is Creighton TV. So you would like to know, is there a subscription while having the Backbone 1 controller or the Backbone app? Yes, there is. Well, after you purchase the Backbone 1 controller, whether it's the PlayStation Edition or the original, there is a one-year free subscription. And then after that, it's $49.99 per year for the subscription. Give you all the features and the perks of what the app has to offer. The app is making improvements and updates. So who knows what else they could, could be adding to the app. And will I keep it? We'll wait till that one year is up and see what happens. So how can you play your Xbox, your PlayStation, your PC games anywhere? Easy, you just stream them over the cloud. Supported apps, you can use Apple Arcade, the App Store, Google Play Store, PS Remote Play, Xbox Game Pass, Steam, Google Stadia, Nvidia GeForce, Amazon Luna, and many more. Play over Wi-Fi, play using your cellular data. No console, no problem. You can also find games that support controller support in, a, in the App Store. All you gotta do is just look here for this icon. So in this section, we're gonna talk about how to record your gameplay. What is the best settings to use? You can actually live stream to Twitch or YouTube. Uh, if you record your gameplay, allow access to it can access to your photos. You can take a screenshot. You can create highlights. So again, your recorded gameplay can go to your photos app. So for your controller, if you, uh, you want to go down to captures and the settings, record mode. You got smart record, and you can read that right there. Hold the capture button to save the last 15 seconds, or you can have it record everything. And the capture button is, I'll show you right here, bam. This is the capture, record video settings. You know, you they have 720p, 30 FPS, 1080, uh, 30 or 60 FPS. Now keep in mind, every minute that you record of gameplay, it does, look, zoom in down there, the megabytes, what it takes up for 
the recording. So yes, that does take up what it is recording. So if you don't have a lot of storage on your phone, I recommend using what you can as possible. If not, delete some stuff. If you do have a lot of storage, and you know, go ahead and feel free and play with it. But me, I'm trying to get the best quality of gameplay gameplay ever. So I went to 1080 60 FPS. You got the format. Especially on iPhone, you want to use, uh, you can use high efficiency or you can do use most compatible. If you want to use reduce file size and use this one right here. But if you want the best, I will use most compatible. If you have the storage in for it, bit rate, you can set that to auto. You can live stream to Twitch and YouTube. This one right here, right here, it's already set up for Twitch. For YouTube, you have to do it another way. So it's not actual in the Backbone app itself. Yes, and now's a new day. I did change my shirt. So yes, in this section, I'm going to show you how to, you can use the Backbone controller, play on any screen, whether it's an iPad, you want to play on your MacBook, PC, Android tablet, Android device. You don't even need the phone to be connected to the controller. So a few things that you will need just to get yourself started. The Backbone controller itself. And this one right now, I'm using a Lightning to USB-C cable. You want to plug it into your MacBook, this cable will work fine. So whatever device that you're going to use the controller with to plug it into, get and make sure you have a Lightning to... USB-C or USB-A cable. So to know what device you are going to be using the Backbone controller on to play on any device, make sure you have your phone connected to the controller first so you can go through the settings. That way you'll be able to select the screen that you're able going to play your device on. Let me show you down right here. You wanna to go to the settings, you wanna to go to controller where it says play on any screen. Here you will be able to select what device you wanna play on such as your iPad, Google Chrome, PC, Android, or tablet. And then just follow the on-screen instructions. What you will need is your Lightning to USB-C cable or Lightning to USB-A cable, whatever cable that you have and you're gonna use for your device. Next section, I'm gonna show you how do you invite your friend so you and your friend can get $10 in games and perks. Real simple. Come to your controller. You can click on rewards. It's right here next to the messages. Click on reward. And then once you do that, it's going to say invite a friend, get $10 to spend on games. But the way it works is once your friend purchases the backbone controller, that's how you get your $10 to with Apple gift cards to buy on games and perks that way. You can share your link. My link will be down in the description box down below. So if you purchase one, I will get $10 and you will get $10. You can add me so we can play some games together. Here's my username across the screen right now. You got any questions and stuff like that? So add me right there and we can be getting down on Backbone. But yes, this is how it really works. So if you invite your friend and they buy a Backbone with your link, you both get $10 in Apple gift cards for games and perks. Next is having the backbone controller really work? To me, I'm gonna say yes. There's some little pros and cons with it. It's a good device to use, especially if you wanna travel with it. Here it is with the phone inside. That's what it looks like. If you don't wanna bring an actual physical controller, you don't really need the app, but the backbone is like a third party that keeps all your games in all in one place. You know, that way you don't have to switch back and forth. Who wants to keep doing all that switch back and forth? You know, you could party with your friends. If you have plenty of friends on it, talk to them, set up a party chat, you know, just go into the backbone app. There you go. You can just start playing. So I would say, yes, it does. It is worth it. You do get monthly perks for games that pop up on there. You can stay up to date with notifications, you know, capture and edit your gameplay, share it on social media. You get free games to access from the cloud, you know, stay up to date with notifications. You can create highlights with your friends. Maybe a highlight may go viral. Here it is again. Here is the Backbone controller. Will you be purchasing it? Do you already have one? Like this video, subscribe if you are new. My shareable link will be down in the description box and the comment section down below. Do buy one using my link. We both get $10 in games. And if you want to check up this video up here, me unboxing the controller and giving you an overview of how to set it up and everything, you can watch that video over there. You know, YouTube thinks this video here is next what you should be watching. Take care, everybody. God bless. And I'll catch you guys on my next upload. Peace.